Good day, viewers. You are highly welcome to Afri's Concept TV, the number one reliable channel where you can be enlightened on different kind of news like sports, political news, top news, local news, name it. So viewers, don't hesitate to click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to get notifications whenever I drop any video. Thank you and have a wonderful day. News updates. Why Osimbajo should fight back or resign? The Arewa Youth Consultative Forum, AYCF, has charged Vice President Yemi Osimbajo to fight back because he has been ridiculed in the presidency. Speaking exclusively with Daily Post, AYCF President General Yerima Shetima warned that Osibajo risked being removed if he failed to fight back or resign as vice president. Shetima stated this in reaction to the sack of some eight attached to the vice president, insisting that the current government has undermined Osibajo. Shetima wondered why the vice president has remained silent in the face of his travail in the presidency. According to Shetima, we have discovered that certain people at the corridors of power are manipulating the system for their selfish interests. Like it or not, somebody somewhere wants to ensure that the vice president was put off the system. To, so that he cannot find his way to the presidency in 2023. One thing about this government is no matter how they pretend something is wrong, the moment they said the presidency and his vice were in good terms, I know something was wrong because they cannot be smoke without fire. Instead of sacking it of the vice president, why not look at the national assembly if really they want to reduce the cost of governance in nigeria why not look for a way of placing so many aids there doing nothing on allowances or reduce the number rather than look at the office of the vice president some of us know that the battle line has been drawn osibajo is serious being on the mind this is a clear indication that he is a target and they want to pull him down. I am surprised that he has not come out boldly to seek the sympathy of Nigerians and speak his mind. He is sitting there quietly because he wants to prove to Nigerians that he is a man of God. The issue of politics is not the matter of God. It is about issue. Professionalism must have to come to play. I know he is a professor of law but he needs to come out and tell nigerians what is going on if he continues to stay quiet he will just wake up one morning and discover that he has been removed the office of vice president has been ridiculed so for me it's either he is out to fight or he resigns because if he does not and cannot fight back then certainly they would remove him through any means. Nobody thought it was possible to remove the Chief Justice of the Federation, but they did it easily. So how more the Vice President that is a spare tire of the President, the head of the judiciary was removed and they frustrated him and nothing happened. Thank you viewers for listening to this news. If you have any comments concerning this news, that I just listened to about the advice given to the Vice President Yemi Sibajo by the Arewa Youth uh, Consultative Forums. If you have any comments on this, don't hesitate to drop your comment below. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to get more updates. Thank you and have a wonderful day. Expect more news. Thank you and goodbye.